Hey y'all, welcome to Coco. Um, so this morning just uh, just had to be a crazy morning for me. Okay, this hair is all on my forehead. It has to be a crazy morning. Starting off with no air in my tire, and then now my car is saying no key in the fog. Like, can you make the morning even better? I can't find my battery that was in the car. So I'm praying that I make it to work while it's saying that. So I had to go a different route. I didn't want to hit the highway the whole time just in case. Just in case I don't. Um, damn, this bus just going to come over? Jesus. This is the morning. And wonder why I have so much anger. So, I'm on my way to work trying to get there safely. Um, I don't like driving like this. Um, I'm going to have to go to CVS and get me some more batteries. I could have sworn I had enough batteries. And I've been going through this for a while. So it's basically my fault because I knew I needed um, a new key. I definitely need a new key. And I've been going through this for a minute needing a key. <sighs> this is my morning. Like we were driving crazy out here. The bus almost ran me over. I can't even say side swipe because if he would have hit me with that bus, it would have been done for me. He didn't even have his blinker on, so ain't no point of fighting no case. I ain't here to fight it. So, you had these tires um, low, and like this right here is like two strikes. Let me know my morning is going to be after my day, too. Only thing, only thing is, and then my, you know what? I'm just not having a good day. So, I'm talking to y'all so y'all can make my day. Um, I did want to hit the highway, but this is going to make me really late for work coming this way. I just got to remind myself that I got to go to CVS. Um, so I come home, oh, guess what? The car won't be sorry. No, I could have sworn I had it. A, a, um, I never battery, but apparently I don't. So, I just wanted to let y'all know. On another note, I have my eye on this bag that I want to get myself. Um, but I'm trying to see when should I do it because if I order it on my birthday, I won't. You know, of course, I won't get it, have it on my birthday. So, I'm thinking about I might order it Wednesday or Thursday. I may, but I did order a Rebecca makeoff. I think it's an um, envelope bag. Um, it was a bag that I was just gonna get, like, when I go out on my special day, I was just gonna wear it and. Like a clutch, it's a, a clutch. I think it's Leo Clutch. I think that's what it's called. A Leo Clutch by Rebecca Minkoff. And I looked at the review from one of the YouTubers I follow. And um, it looks like it's cute. I mean, I got a lot of um, little small wallets that will fit nicely in there. Because it looked like one of those um, clutch that you could just put your cars in. And I told you all, when it, I get small bags like that, I don't feel comfortable just putting my cars in there. I have to have a a separate wallet. So it looked like I can get a lips, my lipstick, my phone, my wallet, and lotion. And of course my female. So I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a review. It's being delivered to my um, job. I think it'll be here on the 10th. 
So if it come earlier than that, of course, I'll just do a review and pull out what I currently have in my, I'm sorry, y'all gotta get over. Pull out what I currently have in my bag so I can see how much room, cause that type of bag is meant to be flat and you don't wanna, oh my God. You don't wanna put a whole lot in there. I'm trying to get over. Come on, baby. No, you're not. No, you're not. You should have been got over. No, you're not. No, you're not. <laughs> Why'd they hit me? No signal. Just come over. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do a review on that. I hope. And this is a champagne color. The one that she had was like a glitter. I wanted that one because it seemed like it was more sturdy. But on a, you know, I still went to, um, I always try to find the stores who have it. That way it will, um, let me know if I really want it. So I did do that. I, um, went in Nordstrom and I, it was only like $95. So I'm going to do a review on that and give y'all my thoughts on it. I kind of feel better now that I'm talking because I mean, I still got to make it work, but I want to make it there safely. I'm, I need to really lose weight because my neck looking chunky. And the 20, the, the birthday uh, countdown to lose weight is not working. It's definitely not working. I got to do better. It's not even just for the birthday thing. I just got to eat better anyway. Um. This this weight thing not working for me. I mean, it's it ain't, it's not putting me down or anything, but I just feel like I need to do it. Everything's so tempting. Like this is on sale. You like, oh, let me let me go try it out. But I still need to do a mukbang on um, Chip Fil A. So I don't know if I'm gonna do it today or not. But it would be good. I wish I could do it on my break. And somehow, I don't think Chick-fil-A um, delivered in my, in my um, area where, I'm, where I work at. So, this lipstick feels really chalky. Oh my God, sweetheart. Can we, can we move it today? So, yeah, I'm making my, this, I don't really have much to update you all on anything. But once I get that bag. It's on. Oh my God, y'all. You can put so much in that bag. And I don't want to tell you about it yet until I officially order it and it's shipped. Because anything can happen. You can place your order. Like, oh, it's not in stock. And I done told everybody I'm getting it. No. But it is a nice bag. I'm thinking about get a, uh, getting a large, and this one is extra, extra large. And it's pretty much like the same size of my, it might be a little smaller than my, um, Tory Burch. Um, but I, li I like this and it's soft leather. So I don't know if I'm going to have to get something to keep it sturdy, but we'll see once I get it, if it call for me to do that. Cause I'm scared. Cause I, the young lady said, but she got to use and when you get soft leather, sometimes in the in the um, corner of the bag, it sometimes get worn off. Because I had soft leather um, Mark Jacob bag. And it was a soft leather. It was flimsy. It didn't have much support. And what happened was it um, start wearing. And I'm very careful with my bag. So I don't understand. It was just wearing a lot. So, um and discoloration it it just start looking real bad so i don't know if i need to buy some type of leather treatment for it but i still want the bag it don't even cost that much it costs like 248 if that so i mean come on i mean i'm, I'm still it's still a lot but compared to my other ones that i want um i still think that's cheap please 
And then with Nordstrom, they have a policy, anything, you know, you don't like, it's worn, as long as you have your receipt or whatever. I don't know if they changed the guideline or anything. Um, you can bring it back. So, that's another good thing. So, I'm quite sure they still do that. But as long as you have your receipt, and I don't know if it's a certain amount of days. But this young lady had her bag for six months, and she says, well, I don't wear my bag six months straight, and I keep it in the dust in the dust bag. She didn't do that. She didn't keep her bag. Are you crazy? Are you really crazy? She didn't keep her bag in a um, dust bag. I'm doing road rage. Oops. But y'all coming along with me. Um... So, yeah, she said she didn't put it in a dust bag. That's strike one for me. I keep all my bags in a dust bag just to protect the quality of it. And if you have soft, hard, any type of leather, you want uh, any bag. If you can, if it come with a come with a dust bag, I'm going to use the dust bag. If it don't, then I'll buy one and keep it because I like and I stuff them as well. Just like they can, I keep the stuffed papers. <coughs> Excuse me. In case I don't wear it. That way it can keep the shape. So. Well, it look like I'm, I might make it to work y'all. I'm like 10 minutes away. I tore my car up. Looking for the battery. And I know what's going to happen. I'm going to come down here on my break time. And look just before I go to CBS Because I know I had. A emergency pack and I clean this car out and just be throwing stuff in the trash and I'm quite sure I'll probably do it in the trash and them batteries not cheap I just get I get really paranoid when it's in no key and fall I wish it would have did that when I lost my first set of keys let me drive all the way home and say no key and fall so where that key at <laughs> you let me drive home so yeah so i will be keeping y'all updated i hope the bag come a little sooner but on a side note i'm still gonna order the other bag because i want y'all to see this one like i don't know if i want to take a break on okay i'm not gonna take a break because i love bags i really need to go to therapy for that too um but i just love it it's like men handbags have a a crazy relationship that I would never break up from. I won't never change it, change my feelings for it. I just have a, oh, let me hold this. I just love, 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 love handbags. So that's something I'm never going to break up from. Um, giving them away? Nope. I already tried that and I find myself losing. You know how you get somebody something and then you look, you like, oh no, nah, she ain't she ain't taking care of it like me. And I'm like, so it, just to keep me sane, instead of seeing this person later on with you carrying it, I'd rather keep it for myself because I know how I'm gonna take care of it. So I'm gonna show y'all this bag. I'm gonna show you the envelope one. The Leo clutch when I get it. Oh my god, it's cute. It's I'm just something I'm wearing for one night and then I put it to the side but i'm gonna order this other bag that i want y'all to see i mean i'm doing this man, until i get my dream bag or not <laughs> so i'm gonna keep y'all posted if you're not already subscribed to my channel why not i'm trying to upload videos more often for you all i think i'm getting a little better i'm getting a little more comfortable um doing more makeup tutorials for you all I'm showing you the new products that I buy from Ultra or Sephora. Um, I think this Fenty 440 Neutral is doing pretty good for me. I did buy Revlon Plop, so that looked like it's helping me a little more. I'm not as shiny, but we'll see as, as the day goes on how I'll feel. Um, but again, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And like I always say, live life to the fullest. You only live once. Thank you for tuning in to Coco. Bye, guys. Perfect. Perfect.